Hello my dear viewers, welcome to this channel, welcome to this reading. This reading is for all Sagittarians for September 2022 and it's a love reading regarding love, relationships, where you are currently right now and where you will be in the very immediate future. What's happening and all that and what are the most important factors that are impacting you. Let's see what's impacting you right now in the current situation love love relationships september onwards for all sagittarians the major thing that's affecting you now and it looks like you're moving on you are leaving a situation behind and moving forward what else is impacting you at this current time okay so we have got two sixes it's amazing a new path is coming you're leaving one path moving towards the light and then we've got the six of wands which is all about rewards from the universe for um something that you've done so well you are going to get so much reward so much recognition and the beginning of prosperity spiritual prosperity prosperity in every way coming to you from all angles and that is magnificent let's have a look at this is your current situation let's see what else the universe wants you to know also in september onwards we're going to take four cards let's see the truth love relationship situations the first card we have the empress wow this is a very nurturing powerful energy that's going to give you everything you've always wanted you are finally going to have what you wanted areas in your life where there were not there was no prosperity there was no fruitfulness you couldn't move forward you couldn't you couldn't get what you want you are able and will be able to get exactly what you want a lot of fertility in your life at this point in time uh, with a lot of abundance so this happens right after you're moving on um, then we have a soulmate so the universe is going to reward you one of the rewards that we talked about rewards one of the greatest reward is going to be this energy of the empress giving you the goddess of nurturing and abundance giving you your soulmate bringing on your soulmate someone incredible that you're going to unite with heal together become strong together work well together and create something glorious and forever this is uh, the soulmate that is forever someone that you are going to spend the rest of your life with that's what the universe is giving you now we have another card two more cards now my dear viewers there is going to be a conflict before you're actually um releasing the situation and moving on conflict and um, disagreements are going to come to an end because there is a very happy life destined for you dreams and wishes being established having the home that you always wanted having everything at your fingertips especially um, with the soulmate coming in your life I feel like your dreams are going to be coming true and you are going to have that happy ever after with a lot of um, dreams and wishes of family home life what you wanted what you couldn't have in the previous relationship that you left behind you are going to have now because you are going to be with your soulmate so that is truly magnificent and that is one of the greatest rewards that's that's here for you with the six of wands okay now what i'm going to do is find out you are leaving as you can see the card here is about leaving leaving with regret you're not happy leaving but you had to leave because emotionally you were not happy you're moving to find um, a better life a better future let's have a look at the two of okay let's find this out a little bit about how the fact that you're moving let's see what the universe wants to tell you about that moving towards what and what is the reason what is um, taking you to the next level and the next level is being taken you might be meeting someone in spectacular of earth energy someone that has virgo or taurus or capricorn in them someone that's going to be very reliable dependable you can rely on they've got earth energy in them doesn't necessarily mean they're born under the sign of an earth energy but they do have that and they are extremely wonderful this person is coming into your life but the most important reason why you're moving on i wanted to know the reason because there is a great prosperity distant for you a renewal arise like the phoenix you're rising and starting fresh that you're going to be healed you're going to be compensated for everything that you didn't get in the past progress the sun is going to be shining and giving you all the radiance and all the progress that you need many areas of your life will thrive and prosper and you will rise and soar high and get everything you always wanted justice for you in every way everything that you didn't get you are going to be getting that is amazing and you've got the power of the empress to do that so um that is magnificent let's have a look at what else will the empress give you 
There was a card coming out, but I've got to cut them. The truth about the Empress for all Sagittarians. Emotional fulfillment and stability, wealth, happiness. But stability with someone of Earth energy. Again, there is that Earth energy. We had the page and now we've got the King. Someone that has Earth energy. Virgo or Taurus or Capricorn very strong within them which gives them that stability that dependability that's someone that you can rely on someone incredible that you can build with and move forward with I feel like um, it is going to be someone spectacular I feel like it's going to be a soulmate and emotionally you will be finally have emotional fulfillment but now for some of you it could be also it could be that you might be meeting someone of water energy Scorpio Cancer Pisces that is a possibility with earth energy within them that could be also a possibility someone with earth and water water being scorpio cancer pisces either one but this is also connecting you to the soulmate i feel like this your soulmate has got earth energy and when i do the immediate future in a few moments well, i will find out what is what are the three combination star signs that are within your soul person and the one that's coming in the immediate future if you haven't already met them i will find that out for you but there is stability in your life without a doubt let's have a look at this conflict and see what this conflict is in regard to all sagittarians what is this problem all about it might be something minor okay it is to do with the truth and your choices of life um, i feel like there is some sort of truth that's coming to light. There is a separation. There might be some betrayal that you might find. But some truth, asking all the questions, asking all the right questions, you are getting the truth and somebody could be helping you get the truth. But it is about some sort of betrayal, some sort of injustice, some sort of truth that's very painful. Separation is right there. Um, destined in this situation i feel like some situation is coming to an end let's have a look at the six of wands and the rewards that are coming your way and then i will go through um okay so you are expanding and moving forward again another card of rewards the three of wands and the six of wands are cards of rewards from the universe and from the uh, from your guiding angels you are going to be empowered power control over your life over your destiny over your emotions finally you will have um the strength this uh, the power to move on some of you could be either dealing with an aries or leaving an aries behind or moving forward but ultimately there is a new beginning destined one that's going to be very prosperous and it's going to give you abundance i'm going to take that my god and there's another one they're both there for you so abundance a new project that's going to be doing incredible a new relationship a new love that's coming it's going to be very prosperous both of these beginnings are destined for you so you are having it all i feel like this could be bringing you the true love of your life i feel like ultimately um you are going to have a renewal and the sun is going to support you have everything you want with a lot of progress and a lot of healing a lot of healing is taking place i can see that with these new beginnings now that we have an idea of what's happening in your current situation let's move forward towards the um i'll just take these cards out towards the uh, story of today what's happening uh, not sorry <laughs> the immediate future the story of today was this one this was the story of today where you're at so now what i'm going to do is find out more for you about your current situation let's have a look what are the two major impacts immediate future meaning next weekend for all sagittarians love relationship what am i doing okay love relationship for all sagittarians here we go the truth wow the three of wands again this is this card it repeats a lot of rewards that will expand and elevate you to heights uh, not this card sorry where is the three of wands it was just here Maybe I didn't take it out, but I'm sure I did. Anyway, the th oh, here it is, sorry. The Three of Wands, that's this card here. It's all about, remember I said this is another card like the Six of Wands. This is the Six of Wands, the Three of Wands. Recognition and rewards for a job well done, for everything that you have been compensated. You will be compensated for everything that you've been doing and not receiving. You haven't been on the receiving end, and now you will be with your soulmate, your mind, everything, your perception is changing. You are literally changing your mind. I feel like, and what you don't see coming is amazing. I just, I looked at it and I just put it there, which is um, the high priestess. No, sorry, the empress. This is the empress, the power and the energy of the goddess that gives you abundance and gives you everything. So um, this is magnificent, truly. Now, we have an idea where you're at. We've got this 
and that what did I actually get I'm getting oh yes a little bit ahead of myself so we've got this one as the major impact I think we need one more that's impacting you in the very immediate future so we can have an idea yes the two the two of pentacles came up before it showed itself and now again you are at the crossroads you want to make a choice you need you've been waiting for the right moment but now finally you are you are going to be making the right decision especially if it's in regard to a relationship i will find out more for you as i do the cards i will work out what the two of pentacles is one more card from the sacred um, regarding immediate future for all sagittarians love life you are transcending this is pegasus the um the card of transcension moving to a better situation moving to a better life you're transcending from where you are to better places and better, better heights i want one card from this deck which i love um, just one card to tell me about uh, what is happening what is the major impact that's going to impact your life um, immediate future for all Sagittarians love life just one card and it's the high priestess I wish I could talk to the high priestess is about you are finally going to be in touch with your with your higher self you are empowered your higher self wants to tell you something it wants to prepare you for the immediate future it wants to say to you that you're transcending where you are now you're reaching to heights beyond your imagination you're finishing a chapter and you are transcending to a better life to an incredible new life it's it's trying to tell you that but maybe you're not uh, quite there maybe you are too involved now and slowly maybe it's trying to tell you that your soulmate is coming be prepared for that that could be a possibility but anyway um ultimately um we are going to find out more as to what's happening let's have a look at a few more cards about the immediate future and what is coming for you the truth some of you might have already met your um two cards you might have met your soulmate already because this is the current situation now september now what we got here we got the six again repeated this card that you're leaving you're leaving behind someone and you're moving forward you're leaving a situation and moving towards a light towards a better future that card doubled up the six of swords it shows that this is going to be impacting your life at this point in a big way and there is a proposal someone is going to propose right after leaving there is a proposal that is going to give you an abundance of happiness the nine of cups is about someone very interested and it could be your soulmate uh, showing you um, the interest that they have in you, getting to know you more. Um, there could be a proposal, a marriage proposal. That could be possible, you know, living together proposal. There is something magnificent here happening. Um, someone wonderful that really wants to um, wants to extend their way with you, their, 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 their position with you. The relationship will be escalating and getting deeper and deeper. But I'll find out more. Two more cards as to what's happening in the immediate future for all Sagittarians. Yes, you are going to be in need of. By the way, there is a big uh, a big rise in your finances and your money, even though this is not financial reading. We can call these happiness at times too, but they are pentacles and they are to do with money. Now, let's have a look at this. It says that there is some decision that you have to make. You are at the crossroads, crossroads now. There will be some news coming your way, some opportunity for you to take advantage of. And you are going to take advantage it looks like quick action is needed you could be relocating moving to a better place but i feel like you are moving moving towards a better place it shows that you're moving in regard to transcending where you are in regard to this card here it shows that you are moving to a better place and the two of wands shows a big change in life an amazing new beginning that's going to give you abundance and the rewards like i said are endless endless rewards now let's have a look at you moving again what else they want to tell you are the rewards connected to your move to where you're locating let's have a look yes there is going to be a great victory and wow look at this the ten of cups you are going to reach to the highest level of happiness i'll take this um, and put that aside now this is what you don't see coming so this movement when you are moving and going towards the light to a better place you are going to overcome all obstacles and have a victory there is going to be commitment you are committing to do something something magnificent and i feel this commitment and this victory and this journey that you're taking and moving on is going to bring on happiness to the highest level and i feel like you are destined for this happiness i feel like it's about time you've been through so much and you've waited for so long and you've been 
patient and giving and giving and now it's time for your rewards and i feel like you are going to be with your soulmate and um you are going to finally reach the level of happiness where you won't need for more and you will sit comfortably um this person that's destined to be in your life could be this earth energy i feel like you are going to grow together and heal each other and it's someone very someone very reliable someone you can trust someone that wants the same thing and the life and the love together is effortless that's what i'm seeing and that's what your higher self is trying to tell you but um okay so um what i want to know now is about the two of pentacles twice the two of pentacles came and that's very important i want to see what the two of pentacles really is trying to tell you i mean i know there's a great happiness there but i want to know what is the two of pentacles really for all sagittarians the truth about this card um oh wow again oh my god look at that that is shocking truly shocking what i'm seeing here okay what you don't see coming the renewal like the phoenix the abundance the wealth that's there for you and there's the other one money big money is coming to you i saw that in the last reading it keeps coming but you know what's amazing this is what's amazing look what's repeated it repeated when they repeat you know there is the magnitude the intensity becomes do you see that so after the move there is the happiness maybe you are reluctant and you're thinking should i move will i be happy yes 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 repeat it so twice it's repeated it's showing you that you are going and there is going to be a lot of happiness destined for you as soon as you leave and um, the happiness is repeated twice to show you the ten of cups came in two different decks twice and also it shows the 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 pentacles wealth and abundance is coming there's a rise in your life there is abundance where is archangel gabriel here we go there's doubled up the renewal compensation for everything that has happened a new lease on life that's destined for you a new destiny that's why you're leaving a new destiny that's taking place for you doubled up this doubled up this happiness is doubled up it's destined for you i'll, I'll keep repeating it it's okay you can skip me but you please try not to <laughs> uh, try to see the the intensity of what i'm seeing it's it's very 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 important this is going to impact your life in a big way and there is the card of wealth what your money reading your finances i feel like there is a, a grand win for you wealth is coming to the highest level it could be that you might be meeting someone very wealthy this is the card of wealth also not only someone of earth energy but someone very wealthy so um your financial status you will rise and transcend that to reach to heights beyond the imagination play the lotto play the lottery um you can get your lucky lotto numbers in your money reading so that's there for you um uh, it's very important that you know that this certain happiness that is destined for you uh, it is going to be with a soulmate not just a lover this is going to be a soulmate that means it's effortless and it's long term it's forever and that's what's destined now let's see let's see what else does the universe want to want you to know is there anything that i haven't talked about and you need to know we've got one any messages for you the immediate future what you need to know my dear viewers we've got determination it says pers perseverance leads to fortune fortune means luck and everything luck and money big win like i saw like we talked about big fortune and it can mean meeting the soulmate meeting the soulmate is the luckiest thing on the planet that can happen because it's very rare to meet your soulmate very rare that we meet our soulmates so um, there's great luck and fortune coming your way and also it says beyond the ego surrender to the flow of life surrender because what's coming it's magnificent so surrender to the beat of life and the flow of life and you will reach to the next you there will be unfolding the mysteries that are hidden from you that are magnificent for you they will be revealed to you very soon that's why the universe keeps repeating so that you are aware that this is happening now let's have a look at your love life and what's coming we're going to find out about the person we'll just see where you're at you're at now and where you will be very soon all sagittarians immediate future truth okay so it says it's safe to fall in love so if you have chemistry with someone and it starts with chemi chemical chemical uh, connection 
where there is a magnetic attraction between you and someone, know that this is your soulmate. It's going to escalate. It's going to get stronger. Feel safe to do so. If you've just come out of a relationship, feel safe to fall in love. It's okay. Open your heart and give and receive the highest gift and energy of all, which is love. Nothing more can be more powerful than love. So um, do look at that um, and consider that. Let's have a look at who you are destined to be with in the immediate future. And what are their star sign combination and their personality? Let's have a look. The truth for all Sagittarians, who they're going to be with. So we got Capricorn. There, there, there goes the Earth energy straight away. Remember, I said to you there is going to be very strong Earth energy in the person. So there could be a Capricorn or Virgo or Taurus. That's another Earth energy, but it's the universe is nominating Capricorn. So there it is. Earth energy, very strong. Someone very comfortable, very um, dependable. You can depend on them. Now, uh, the other sign that's going to be within the person destined for you, all Sagittarians destined with who? What other star sign combination? Two more. We've got Neptune, which is Pisces. And then finally, one more. And where is it? Here it is. And then we've got Pluto, Scorpio. So we're talking about someone with these attributes and these star signs within them. Capricorn, Earth energy, Neptune, Pisces, and Pluto, Scorpio. So I'll make it easy. Capricorn, Pisces, Scorpio, water energy, earth energy earth and water they go well together this person is going to be quite comfortable um they are going to be very very um uh, what's the word someone that you can rely on someone that is very honest and very truthful someone that's loyal they love family they love creating um, their own family and their own world there's so someone very deep very deep and very delightful um, being Pisces, very delightful, very um, refreshing from where you were before. I've seen Pisces for um, coming into Sagittarius life and Earth very strong and now I know it's Capricorn. Um, Scorpio, depth, analyzing, caring, um, you know, they're very much into mystery and you love that too, Sagittarius. Uh, Pisces, they're into passion, they're into, they're very sensitive, very true and very, very uh, magnetic. So this magnetic energy that is here is connected to um, the water energy more than anything else. The water energy is the one that is very um, strong chemistry is the water energy here. So um, the earth we already talked about, the chemistry that is going to be with this earth energy is going to be overwhelming and it's going to be beautiful. So it is someone incredible and you will fall in love head over heels because ultimately you will be meeting your soulmate it's not just anyone it's your soulmate no matter how uh, how it might be at the beginning because you've just come out of a relationship but you will be with the person that's destined for you and happiness is imminent and it's destined nothing can uh, change that you are destined to be with someone wonderful and have the happiness that you truly deserve and i will leave you with that blessings to you all and namaste